everybody! So today I am going to be showing you guys my jewelry collection because in my makeup collection video I asked you guys if you wanted me to go over my jewelry and the top comment multiple times was yes and I've been getting a lot of tweets about it also. So here I am doing my jewelry collection for you guys and I am just going to be going over how I store my jewelry and I'm going to be talking about each piece like where I got it and stuff like that. And if you watched my makeup collection video, this will look familiar because I store my makeup, jewelry, and nail polish in the same place. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's go ahead and jump into everything. So this is where I store all of my jewelry and if you saw my makeup collection video then you will recognize this. This is the jewelry armoire from the Pier 1 Hayworth collection and up top here I have MC Hammy as always. This is his permanent home and then I have this glass heart container with my Michael Kors watch and my most worn bracelets at the time. So currently I have been wearing this bracelet from Daily Look which I've been loving. This is a pack pastel colorful bracelet and it reminds me of Easter but I love Easter colors so that's why I got this bracelet I just love it and I've been wearing it a lot and it just kind of dresses up like a plain t-shirt and then down here I have my bobble bar bracelet which I have talked about a lot this is a rose gold bracelet with some crystals on it that I have been wearing so much. I wear this a lot with my Michael Kors watch. And then down at the bottom here, I have my rose gold May Movement bracelet. Moving on to the rest of my jewelry, I just open up these doors here. And on the inside, I have my necklaces hanging because it comes with these little hooks here where you can hang your necklaces. So I have my gold and colorful necklaces on this side. And then on this side, I have my silver necklaces and I've also been hanging these bangles here and I have some mint green ones. These are from Forever 21 and I haven't worn them yet. They were like $5.80 for a whole stack which I thought was a really great deal. So I have a bunch of these that I got for summer because I thought they would just be fun to wear. But I'm going to go over everything with you guys. Up here I have a couple headbands. These are from J. Crew, and I got these on sale at J. Crew. They were originally like $15 and I got them for $4. So this is a rose gold headband and then I got this silver one too. So these are just skinny little headbands that I like hanging here so I know where they are. And then I have this which could be a necklace or a bracelet. It's actually a mold moldable piece of jewelry that I got from Brandy Melville. And I but you could like mold it into a cool shape and then leave it out on a table as decoration, which I think is really awesome. So I have that bracelet and then I have this little panda necklace that I got from Luke for Christmas and I love it. He's holding a little piece of bamboo and he has little crystals on him. And then this necklace is really old. This is a key necklace that I got from Forever 21 a really, really long time ago. And then this necklace here, I think this is from Urban Outfitters, but I'm not sure. I got this a while ago, so I really can't remember where it's from, but I think it may be from Urban Outfitters. This necklace here is from Windsor. And then this flower necklace down here was a gift from Fleur a couple years ago. And then these bracelets were from Thailand. These were gifts from my cousins. Then on this side, this is where all the fun colorful stuff is. So I have this yellow chain necklace from J. Crew, and it has little crystals on it. It's gold and yellow and I got this on sale at J. Crew also. I highly recommend shopping the sale section at J. Crew because they always have amazing things and I got this for like $20 when it was marked down from like 65 so I got this for a great deal and their jewelry is also great quality so you know that their jewelry is going to last you and it's not going to tarnish and it's not going to turn your skin weird colors and then I have this necklace from Kate Spade this is a flower necklace I really like chunky statement necklaces and then I have another necklace 
necklace from J. Crew. This is a green and aqua and sparkly necklace that I think I got for like $15 at J. Crew. So they have really, really great markdowns on their accessories and on their clothing too. This is another J. Crew necklace that I again got on sale. This is a coral bobble necklace with crystals on it. And then this necklace here, I've been wearing this a lot. This is a teal, a bright teal necklace from Bobble Bar. And I believe it also comes in yellow. I'm not sure if they still have the yellow, but um, it did come in yellow at one time, but I love the teal. And then I have these mint green bracelets from Forever 21. And then down here I have this black geometric spiky necklace that I got from Madewell and I really really love this necklace. It's very modern and that's what I love about it. And then I have this necklace which I've had for a really long time. I think I may have gotten this like in high school. This is a necklace from Forever 21 and then these two necklaces here are from House of Harlow. So the last of my jewelry is all stored up here and I have bracelets and rings up here. So I have more Forever 21 bangles back here. I have them in a ton of colors for summer. And then I have this bracelet, which I got from J. Crew. Surprise, surprise, on sale. Surprise, surprise. This is a pink bracelet that I thought was really cool. And I just liked the shape and the color. It came in a bunch of different colors, but I liked the pink. And then down here, I have this super colorful bracelet from Henry Bendel. This gives the illusion of multiple bracelets when you put this around your wrist, but it's really only one bracelet, which I love. And then I have some vintage jewelry pieces here. This is a bracelet and necklace from my friend's mom. She has an online vintage jewelry shop because one of her hobbies is going out and looking for vintage jewelry. So I have a matching bracelet and necklace and then I also have this vintage um, heart bracelet from her shop. And I love, love, love these pieces so much. They're so beautiful. And then over here, I have a stack of bracelets. So I have this bracelet from Bobble Bar. This has clear bobbles on it with a crystal. And then I have this black one with a crystal bobble on it, also from Bobble Bar. And then I have this studded bracelet from Henry Bendel. And I got this in New York City and I love it. And then I have two of my Thomas Sabo charm bracelets. I have a pearl one with a little heart charm on it. And then I have the pink one with a little silver bow on it because I love bows. And then on this side over here, I have this orange J. Crew bracelet with little crystals on it. And then the rest of my May Movement bracelets here. And then behind it, I have this cuff from Thailand. This is a leather cuff bracelet. And then I have two more bracelets from Daily Look. I've really been loving Daily Look recently. I check the site almost every single day because they have new outfits, like outfits of the day every single day. And the pieces that they show are on sale for that day. So I've been loving their stuff, especially their accessories. So I have this bracelet here. And then I have this kind of like minty jade green bracelet, which is very similar to the one that I have up top with the different colors, but I just love this chunky style. And then in this box here from Henry Bendel, I have my rings. So I have this ring, which I got from House of Harlow. This is a double finger ring, and I really love how this looks. And then I have this set of stackable rings that I got from Henry Bendel in New York. I'm currently wearing the third one that came in the stack. It's a little bow. And then it also came with these two rings. And then I have my Kate Spade bow ring, which I absolutely love. This is one of my favorite pieces. And I've had this for, I think, a little bit over a year now, and I've worn it so much. I just love bows. And then I have a rose gold Michael Kors buckle ring, which I think is super cute. I haven't really seen anything like this before, but I love the little buckle. And then I have one last bow ring. This is a sparkly bow ring from Windsor. So that is it for my 
my jewelry collection and storage and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to keep your requests coming in because you guys come up with fantastic ideas. You can leave them down below in the comments or you can tweet me on Twitter using the hashtag Miss Glam Requests and you never know, you may see your request turned into a video. So I think that's going to be it for today and I will see you guys in a few days with the $20 makeup challenge. And I am very excited for that because I've been loving that video. I've watched every single one that has popped up in my subscription box. And I think it's just a super fun video to do. So I'm really excited for that. And I will see you guys next time with that video. But until then, I hope you all are having a wonderful day.